everybody is not ready to face their fear. So this statement, I remember I was reading an article and I gave someone to read that article and someone says, but I don't want to face my fear. I'm frightened to face my fear. So even though it might sound like a good advice, however, everybody at different stages are not, you know, able to face their fears. But in life, let's be practical. When we know that there is someone to protect me, see a parent also, even if there is an occasion of any physical fear also, I know my parent is there or someone stronger, someone more loving and caring for me is there. Therefore also, when we have faith in a higher power, yeah, say even with God, devotion, tum kahu ko darna, as it is said in Hanuman Chalisa, we can overcome many of our fears. Or even if not overcome, we can manage our fears. And most of our fears are only imaginations in our uh, mind. Most of them are because of past inhibitions. But immediately to face them and encounter them without guidance, without counseling, and even if you are counseled, you don't want to face your fears. Because a lot of guilt from the past is there, regrets from the past is there, experiences of the past also are there. Sometimes there can be traumatic experiences which you don't want to relive by even thinking about it. But one thing, if you have that faith, devotion towards someone who loves you in spite of, who accepts you and makes you accept yourself, you can overcome many fears. It comes from self-acceptance. That's why it is said that God does not even need to forgive you. You have to learn to forgive yourself. And forgive yourself doesn't mean that it gives you a sanction to keep repeating it. Don't repeat it again. 